One of the biggest changes a person will make to live a healthy lifestyle is the way they shop. Lots of times people fall into a routine that they think is healthy, but you know what? It's not. Dr. Richard Snellgrove from Eastern Shore Weight Loss is here to tell us how we can relearn how to shop. So where do we start, Doc? Well, you start by getting your mind right. Okay. That's all there is to it. Shopping can be an art if you do it right. Mm -hmm. When you're trying to lose weight and you're trying to get a healthy lifestyle, there's certain things you have to know about the grocery store and certain things you ought to do. Number one, make a plan and shop the plan. Okay. All right, it's like a dive. Make the plan and shop the plan. So get what you want on a list, make a list. Mm -hmm. Make sure it's healthy and stick with that list when you get in the store. Do not go to the grocery store hungry. You hear that all the time. Don't go to the grocery store hungry. You will make bad, bad choices. So make your list ahead of time and stick to the list. Mm -hmm. Once you do that, you've got a good idea of what's going to happen. The second thing is know your grocery store. Mm -hmm. Know the out layout. Know where everything is in the grocery store. And for the most part, they're all similar. Let's talk about that a little bit. They are set up certain ways, lots of them. Do you have any tips on how to navigate the stores to find these healthy choices? Certainly. The, the common theme with all grocery stores is the good, healthy food is on the walls. It's on the outside or the edges. Okay. Now, you've got your fruit and vegetables. You've mm -hmm. got your dairy products. You've got your meats. You've got your seafoods all around the outside. Unfortunately, sometimes you also have your beer and your wine, mm -hmm. but that's okay. We can live <laughs> with that. So sticking to the outside of the store, the edges of the store, as much as possible sticks with your good, healthy food. All right, so if you have to wander into that middle section, another thing you can do is look at some of the labels. What do we need to know about looking at these labels? Well, you, you wander into the black hole of the aisles, and the aisles is where everything bad for you <laughs> is, for the most part. You do have to go get your condiments and whatnot, but when you're looking at food, Food, the label is very important. Now, not only just the nutrition label, how many calories per serving or per portion, but you also want to know, is what's in that going to be healthy for you? Mm -hmm. And that's hard to do sometimes. So a good rule of thumb is the more packaging, the less healthy it is for you. So you've got a can fruit, you've got a canned vegetable, you've got a can right there you're looking at. That can has been cooked most likely, the food in it's been cooked, it's been processed, it's had preservatives added to it. Not a really healthy choice. If you've got fruits or vegetables in a can, get, get back out on the edge and get the fresh fruits and vegetables. So the more processing, the less healthy. The second thing is looking at the number of ingredients. Mm -hmm. You look at the side of the box, you look at the uh, nutrition label and you see that list of ingredients all yes. down the side and it gets confusing and complicated and uh, the rule of thumb is the ingredients at the top of the list are in proportion more in the food than the ones at the bottom of the list so you're getting more of what's on top than what's on bottom so if you're looking at something that's got high fructose corn syrup which yeah. is pretty unhealthy and it's number two on the list mm -hmm. pick up another box of something similar from another company and see if it's a, not in there at all, which would be perfect, or B, six, seven, eighth down the list. The further down the list the bad things are, the less of it they're in there, the healthier it's going to be. So pick the stuff that's healthy. This is all really great tips. How do you think Eastern Shore Weight Loss can help someone go through and learn more about this kind of stuff? Well, we, we teach people um, to try to pursue a healthy lifestyle. Yes, we want you to lose weight, so we are called weight loss, but we, we really emphasize healthy lifestyles. Mm -hmm. You lose weight by following the instructions. Um, Going through the grocery store again, you get into the aisles, uh, it's kind of interesting when you're looking at things. Uh, you, you will notice that the average person eye level is the more expensive, more high branded stuff. Mm. Uh, there is a procedure called slotting that some grocery stores and, and uh, supermarkets use where the big chains pay extra money to get put at eye level. Okay. So you can look low on the lower shelves. You can look up on the higher shelves and maybe find something that A, might be a little less expensive, and B, might be a little healthier for you too. Well, this was just a little starter course for you here this morning. You can, of course, learn a lot more if you contact Dr. Snellgrove and his friends at Eastern Shore Weight Loss. All that information is on our website. Doctor, thank you so much for coming You're in welcome. this morning. Thank you.